Hi, this is Heather with Keep It Simple Social Media, and today we are looking at the Creator Studio on Facebook. As you can see with the blue Facebook logo up here, and over here on the left it says Creator Studio. So we know that we are on our business page in the Creator Studio. But what's really interesting is you can have a look at how your posts are doing when you go into your insights tab on the lower left hand side. So we can see here all our recent posts that we've done on Facebook and we can get a quick overview of the insights on the number of people reached, the amount of engagements, um, how many link clicks. So link clicks means that you've used a URL that the consumer is going to click on and that is going to take them somewhere and preferably it takes them to whatever perhaps it was a listing you were showcasing and now that listing is on your website. So you're driving the traffic from Facebook over to your website. So this is just a quick overview of your recent posts. You can also see here that it has the less, last seven days. If we click the little half diamond, and just to draw to your attention, whenever you see these little half diamonds, they actually go somewhere. So when you click it, you get a drop down menu and you could perhaps see where all these links are on your business page that have created the 555 link clicks in the last seven days and that is a lot of people going to your website in a short period of time so if we click on the links it then loads the links that you were using to get people to go to your website. So that's just a little example and this is the only and that's because this is an ad that is running. And you notice when I take my cursor around all the little things that pop up when I put my cursor over it gives us more information. But we can go into our insights tab over here on the left hand side and Notice it also has a drop down arrow and when we click it, it gives us all the different types of measures that you might want to look at on your business page. An overview would be a good place to start. So if you click on overview, there is the quick overview in the last seven days. Now personally, I don't think a lot of us have time to look at our insights tab once a week. So why don't we just use this little half diamond click it and let's look at the last 28 days and there you go now that's a better picture of what's going on and you can see if you pull your cursor across the lines it tells you on what days how many people you reached and then it tells you the previous period how many people and if you click on any one of these dots it will give you more information. But if you really want to see how well your videos are going over, you just have to go over on the left hand side and also click on videos. So we'll go back up to the insights tab and then we'll go down and look at our performance. There we go, top videos right here. We can look at each video. It gives us how many minutes that video was viewed. It tells us um, how much engagement we got from the video and we can look into see what the videos are. Now these ones aren't giving us the stats anymore because they were they're too old but these are our most recent videos and these are our top videos and it lets us know that when they were posted and lots of valuable information. So why is this information important? It's important because you want to look at what people are engaging with, what people are liking, and that is what you want to produce more of. And consistency. So this real estate agent posts a market update every single week. That is consistent. She has been doing this for over a year and a half now. So she's reliable, she's consistent, and the algorithms are going to help push her content into more news feeds because of these simple reasons. So that's a quick look at the Creator Studio on your business page. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out. This is Heather. And remember, everyone, let's keep it simple.